Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here. I'm back with more Call of Duty Mobile. Today we take a look at the UL736 LMG. It's one of the weapons you unlock super late in the game. You unlock that one at level 115. So today I'm using the purple fashion skin. I don't remember where I got that one, but it looks pretty cool. We're gonna compare the stats with the S36. I did use it a lot recently. And I said that the S36 was my favorite LMG. It's really, really good in my opinion. But I was really impressed with the UL736. I never used it much before. And today I gave it a shot and seriously, great range, great accuracy. It's uh, damage is still pretty good, a bit lower but the improved range and accuracy makes a huge difference. This thing is really precise, guys. I love it. So check the left row of the stats, okay? 70, 45, 55. The S36, 75, 35, 50. So a bit more damage, but the accuracy will suffer and the range also. Now, fire rate is probably the thing I liked a lot on the S36 and the UL736 at 60 is a lower fire rate, but really, really accurate, guys. I really love it. So the problem with all LMGs is definitely the mobility, okay? You're not running much, you're walking. So I did change my settings real quick before uh, playing it on basic. I put my settings to always sprinting because I was struggling and end up uh, walking a lot and struggling with my thumbstick. So I put it to always sprint. Now to help with the mobility, I like to use lightweight also on my LMG classes. You sprint a bit faster, so I guess it's gonna help a little bit. So let's go for some live action. We got Domination. I love this map again. Uh, it should be a good game. And I want to show you guys the recoil on that. Because I told you it's really accurate. And it's like there's no recoil. Like no recoil at all. It's really good. Even from pretty long range. But hey, let's go for B. Let's see if we can... Like, like, like check it out. Oh, okay, nobody here. Oh... Uh, we're gonna get surprised on the side, right? No? Yes, yes, yes. There you go, boom. I thought it was coming from the side. I think I wanna hang in the back and maybe just try to defend B a little bit. Oh, there's a guy up there. Gonna grab your foot. See long range fight. It's crazy. Crazy good from long range. And it's got zero recoil, look at that. It's really accurate. Oh, there's a dude there, right? He's dead. So I got sentry gun, but I'll keep it for next round. There's no point wasting it, right? Like, we're so far ahead right now. It's gonna be pretty short. Bro, you can't you cannot kill me from long range. Boom. Except the snipers, of course. Like they try, man. They can get the headshot, man. It was the end of the round. Hey, can you believe it? It's 50 to 12. This is crazy. I guess I got good teammates because I didn't cap. They went for it. Ah, uh, can we get Vito? Yeah, we got Vito. Right, let's go and drop. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm crouched. Let's go and drop the sentry near B, and then uh, and then let's go Vito, man. Let's go in the corner here, and let's go hide and go Vito. This is gonna be so so cool. Uh, this is not a good map for Vito, though. I don't know, man. Anytime I get it, it feels awkward. Told you guys last time, huh? But it's free kills, man. Some guys are just. Uh, I don't have. I don't have an angle on A. Because I can. I can just cover C and B like that. And if I reposition, I don't have a That's shot over thing. there. See? I can only go back here. I mean, guys. Give me some tips in the comments, please. How do you play VTOL on that map? And come on, B, man. This is crazy. Okay, there you go. But it's not a great angle. 
Some guy's not playing, man. We got all three points. This is game over, right? Oh no! The hip fire at the end. I immediately regret that decision, dude. I killed everyone from long range, but face to face, I got owned. Ah, uh, okay. So that was a short game, guys. But I did show what I wanted to show: long distance fight, no recoil, super accurate, really good. And we got MVP, 1862, the score. And like I said, I didn't cap much, but I didn't have to. So first half, I just kind of defended B. And second half, like very good start. And they kind of gave up, I guess. And 18 and 1, I died once at the end. It sucks, but what can you do? I got surprised. So, okay, that was the UL736 LMG. And I said I really like the S36, but after playing this for a few games, I got a feeling that maybe it's my new favorite LMG in the game. Guys, I want you to try it. Seriously, if you got to level 115 or if you got a skin and you unlock it earlier, you have to try it and come back and let me know in the comments how do you like it for real because it's crazy. I know on some small maps you like the SMGs and stuff and fast fire rate, but on the big maps, if you want to change instead of always using snipers, give this thing a try guys. Uh, you will be surprised the insane accuracy and good damage and no recoil. But by the way, I was using the foregrip, so I don't know if it makes a huge difference, but it does improve the accuracy when firing, uh, aiming down sight. I also use the quick draw for increased aim speed, and I use the fast mag for reloading faster. The tactical scope, I said I started using it more a few weeks ago, and I still really like it. For accurate weapons, the red dot or the tactical scope. And for less accurate weapon, I kind of like the holo sight. But hey, it's really personal, I guess. So that's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Once again, hit the like if you enjoyed. Leave me a comment below. Did you try that? Will you try it? And come back and let me know if you try, all right? Uh, I really like it. I will be back with more. If you enjoyed, please subscribe to the channel. Don't miss an upload. I'll be back soon. Take care.